you've been following my work, you know, I don't believe in this. I don't think that we're on an oblate spheroid. For all we know, the Earth could be flat. And unless you're gonna start asking logical questions to deduce whether there's curvature or we're spinning, <laughs> you're immediately gonna ask me, why in the hell would they lie to us? Why would they lie and say that the Earth is a ball? <laughs> you mean these guys? Why would all the governments of all of the world agree to lie to the human population that the Earth is a ball? In my opinion, to hide God. If we're on a ball, we came from a Big Bang. Just so everybody is aware that does believe in God, the Big Bang doesn't include God. There's no God to the Big Bang. There's supposedly just an explosion and poof, we're all here of all for monkeys. That's the difference here. I used to be an atheist. I used to be a hardcore atheist. Like, yeah, we have spawned from amoebas, totally. Yeah, viruses are real, totally. And then I figured out that the Earth was flat. And I figured out that there's a firmament above us. And the first thing that I asked was, if there's a firmament above my head, who put it there? Yes, people, we're talking about the firmament here. Yeah, obvious. Polaris sits at the top, hasn't moved for centuries. <laughs> yeah, sitting right there. There's obviously a lot more motivation, though, for telling everybody that we're on a ball. Do you remember the Truman Show when he's in school and he tells his teacher that he wants to be an explorer and the teacher tells him there's nowhere else to explore? We figured out the whole globe. We've been everywhere. That's the thing. <laughs> They're lying. They're lying about that, too. There's more land. Yeah, more resources. Past the Antarctic Wall. If you're not up to date, there's this thing called the Antarctic Treaty, like stopping everybody from leaving the Arctic Circle. <laughs> the 60th South Latitude, third page, check the Antarctic Treaty on the third page, it'll say you can't go past the 60th South Latitude without special permission from the government. <laughs> so if they keep us within this circle and tell us there's nothing more, they can inflate the prices on all of the food, all of the oil and all of the water and the rest and just basically make us slaves. This is how the sun works. It's called the inverse square law of light. If you didn't know, light doesn't travel forever. The sun's not 93 million miles away. It's local. Here's like a bunch of experiments that we did in the past proving that the earth is stationary and that the sky moves, guys. <laughs> Nobody seeing these? Guys, this is really simple. They convinced everybody that the Bermuda Triangle is dangerous and scary so that nobody would go sit out there during their launches. It's it's really simple. Once you realize the Earth is flat, you're going to realize that there's intelligent design to this place. We have a god. And if you want to know my opinion, check out my podcast. I just posted an episode, two hours. Link tree in my bio.